I think it's so important to recognize, though, Gamergate and gamers in general are responding to a culture that is set from the top down. Mm -hmm. So when PC Gamer has a very important public event, and you know, they announce that 28 out of 28 of the speakers are going to be white men, that sends a signal to gamers that this is a space for men and not women. When Game Informer has 17 out of 18 of their editors that are men, this signals to gamers that this is not a space for women. Yeah. When gamers play games repeatedly that have women as sex symbols, bimbos, damsels in distress, it sends a signal to gamers that this is not a space for women. So yeah. they are just reacting to the culture that the men in game development have set. Increasing the number of women in tech is the right thing to do, but ultimately, this is an economic issue. Our industry has stagnated. If you look at the PS4 and the Xbox One, we are bringing less innovation to the table than we have with any other generation. We are only using that extra processing power for slightly prettier particle effects and slightly sharper textures and a slightly higher poly count. There's no innovation. We're putting out sequels upon oh, sequels. So I think bringing women into the fold, it's not just women, it's also people of color, it's also members of the LGBT community. I think in increasing the diversity of our field, we're gonna have different games made. Yeah. I've talked to the editors of pretty much every major publication at this mm -hmm. point. Like, I know them. I can call them up and talk to them. And even if they don't have the highest consciousness raised on this, I think mm -hmm. they're aware of the problem and they want to address it in a way I don't think they did five years ago. Mm -hmm. So we are changing it. It's getting better. It's brutal for the women that have to deal with this BS in the meantime. Yeah. Yeah, but what I'm looking forward to is another 10 years into my career well, I don't have to stand on stage talking about this, and I can talk about the games that I'm making instead. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's fantastic. Thank you. Um, yeah. I think that's all the time we have. <laughs> and, and thank you so much. Absolutely. It was wonderful to have you. Thank you. you. Um, thank you. And such an honor to meet you. Thank you, um, thank you for sharing. Thank you. Thank you. Wonderful.